Hi guys, Darren from Venom Fluid Art. We're Bubbles. How'd you get an invite? Play night. Let's <laughs> do this. It's a play night? Yes, welcome to the Venom Garage. Okay, so we're having a bit of a play night tonight. It is. We have no kids. <laughs> Woohoo! Winning. Absolutely. Playing. So. So what are your plans? Bloom double swipe. A bloom double swipe? Yep. On our lovely MDF ran uh, oval. They're oval. They are. I'm so used to going, this lovely oh, MDF yeah. round. Nope, it's an oval. So, one of these. Yeah, it's like 13 inches by 8 inches, I think. Yep. From memory. Absolutely. So I thought we might just take turns and see what we can do, different colours. Cool. Yeah, yeah. I'm in. I'm in. I thought you might be. So I'm going to come out straight away with some of my... One of my all-time favourite Pebios. Blue black. Blue black. Got a thing for this colour. It is a nice colour. Really is. And I'm thinking the trick to this is where you're going to excel. Mm. Because you'd have to be pretty symmetrical. Yeah. And you've got a brilliant eye for that, so... I'm thinking, my love, you may just rock this. That's if I do the same thing. Well, we all know you always change it up. <laughs> it's no surprise. I'm going to change the rules as I go. Anyone that watches Student versus Teacher just knows that that's going to happen. Yes. That yes. one's a bit thick, actually. It is a little bit thick, isn't it? That's all right. I'm going to come out with the Pacific Blue from Eye Candy. That's probably because it's like four degrees Celsius here at the moment. It's all right. Going to make it work. So all the paints are going really thick. That's all right. I like them thick. That's when they rock my world. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, not a, not a th fan of the thin paint. I like globs. Do you like globs? I do love globs. Why is that? They just rock my world. <laughs> nice. Oh, well, you've seen I've even taken paint skin off the top of things before. I have seen that, yes. <laughs> It'll still work, Wombat. Okay. And did it not work? Well, yes, it did, but... Yeah. Probably wasn't the most graceful thing you ever seen, but yes, it worked. It was good to watch. I bet it was. All right. We're going to come out with some of our Stage 2 Southern Ocean Blue. Gorgeous colour. And this is by Matisse. Gorgeous tube paint. It is by Matisse. It is. Not to be mistaken with what you said a few videos ago. Shh. But I got my apology, so I'm smiling politely. See? I can move on. <laughs> you just mentioned it again. <laughs> Did I? Hmm. Oh, funny that. Yeah. Moving right along. Mm hmm So, what I might do... Yeah. I'm going to add the tiniest bit of King Gold to the bloom. Yeah. But not the swipe. Okay. And I think that'll do. Because I'm going to add the King Gold CA. To your swipes. To my swipe. Right. Now I'm going to rock my custom blue. This is like one of my favourite blues. In a gorgeous. It's one of the pastel ones, isn't it? Yeah, it's baby blue with a smile. It look at that. Isn't she pretty? So that was the electric blue by Eye Candy originally. Yeah. That I've tweaked. To make it look amazing. So if you want to see that video, I'll throw that up on the screen now. And you can go back and... Oh, that was cool to pastel up your... Yeah, how to pastel up your neons. And then make you... them bling and shiny. Yeah, and doesn't it just make that little bit of difference, eh? Oh, and awesome plus colors. you can lose, use what you've already got and make extra colour. Exactly. Which is super cool, saves your cash. It does. I think we're going to go down with a little bit of Ruri. Which is the colour shift. Gorgeous colour shift. 
Now, I say it every time. First time I looked at that, I went, that's okay. But once she dries, you go, oh, moi. Yep. It's really a super cool colour, hey? It definitely is. I've been sprinkling that everywhere at the moment. I've noticed. I'm like, well, you better must start making one for you, one for me. It's getting that way. Same as with, um, oh, I'm a bit that way with Cherry Red as well. And since I found Zen Garden. Yeah, you've got a Zen Garden addiction, don't you? Just a little bit at the moment. Just a bit. It's pretty darn cool. Talk about Zen Garden. Yeah, speak of the devil and the devil appears. Yeah, it does. Which is also a colour shift. I'm rocking the colour shifts. You know why? Black base. Yeah, it makes them stand out more. Damn straight it does. Bubbles loves it. Yet, I never used to use a black pillow. That's only developed the last two months. Yeah, you never used to like it at all, did you? No. Only because I kept stuffing it up. <laughs> <laughs> so it wasn't that I didn't like it. It was every time I tried something on it, it was a little bit excrement. So I've worked on that. And my Pebio turquoise. Another bit of chew paint going on. Nice. Pebio Matisse. Such cool tube paints. And they're great for people like Bubbles that likes to spin the crap out of things. Yeah. Because it helps me keep my cells and I still get to spin like a mad woman. <laughs> oh, look, everyone needs that. Long day after work, take it out in the spinner. Take the frustrations out, you reckon? Yeah, damn straight. It is just, it's rewarding. Just like stabbing the bubbles. Which I'll sh demonstrate. In a moment. Right now. Last paint. Down. Now. My magic skewer. And death to the bubbles. Well, not me, because I'm pretty cool, right? Mostly. Mostly. All right, so you're blooming in the middle and two fantabulous little swipes on the sides. Yeah. That's so, pretty cool. Bloom on. I nearly confused myself then. Because they're two different consistency selector baiters you're going to use, aren't they? Yeah, and I took the lids off both at one time. Yeah, and they're both the same colour. Yeah, pretty much. Yes. So your swipe one is a three to one. Yep. And your bloom one's going to be a four to one. Well, I'm hoping so, because I already took the lids off. <laughs> Taste it, you can tell. Yeah, no, I'm not going down that. You're not, you're not getting me. <laughs> I'm not dumb. All right. And I'm going to do the swipes first. <coughs> it's like magic. Magic bubbles. Pot, pot, pot. Oh, look at them cool ones. I love when that happens. That's awesome. That's cool, right? I know. Check it. It's just like two dollops of Gold King CA in the <coughs> middle of your black. So, for anyone that hasn't tried it, that's about as difficult as it gets. Not two drops. And it gives super cool effects. It does. But like really, really simple to do. Anyone can have a go at that. Absolutely. All right. Now, is George awake? Let me check. Hello, uh, boy. Yep, sure he is. See, and that's why, because I didn't want to put um, gold CA in the bloom. I just wanted to use black. Yep. So I figured if I had the King Gold paint down, she's still going to match up enough for me. Yeah. Good idea. 
Every now and then I get one. All right. <coughs> I'm not going to go stupid on the CA because it's only a little puddle. And watch this pillow, darling, because it is getting thick. Yeah, because it's like freezing cold. I'm going to leave that for a minute. Yeah. i got a feeling it's going to sink nice. So then what I'm going to do is just tie my shoelaces. No one's done it yet. Come on, people. Get on board. <laughs> really? Yeah, I'm starting a trend. Okay. So and besides, it's so easy to do. Let's do it in slow motion. I'll zoom in. And so we can actually see how you do it. So simple to do. Let's have a look. And when it opens up and you spin it, crazy cool effects. All right. So you just go on that side of the shoe with your little bow. Yep. Then come back up and bring it down with a twist. How cool is that? And lift it up. And see the cool little pattern you get? That is a fantabulous pattern. And anyone can have a crack at it. Tying our shoelaces, people. You know, it's when, like when you watch the movie Big Daddy. Loop, scoop, swoop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're going, you're an idiot. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you go and see what I live with, people? Yeah. yeah. Fun and games. That's why the wombat is not normal. Apparently He's putting so. up with the bubbles. You'll get used to it. So you keep telling me. So I'm going to leave that there because I've got a pretty good size pillow going on for such a little piece. You do. So let's just see how we're going to move. So I'll take it a little bit gentle at first. I get really bored when you do that, you know. <laughs> really? Well, the fun is in the rabbit. Oh, that's cool. See how they're opening up? Yeah. Now, I'm going to say that's about <coughs> the halfway mark. Yeah. Oh, she's opening up pretty. Yeah. So, halfway mark, so your pillow's still not quite spun all the way out. So at your time, if there's something you're sort of going... Mm, you need to adjust it. Could be better. You've got that time to grab your little skewer out before you're stuck with something you hate. Because right. that would suck. So we'll get a bit of dark going on there. Now, you know what I'm going to do? Mm. I'm going to make cells. Make your own cells? Yeah. Look. Drag paint through to make them look like circles? Yep. Yeah, how tricky is that? There you go. Fixed it. Yeah, it looks like a little up heart. Yeah. Uh, I think it's better. All right. We need something there. Something just there. Mm hmm. Break up that dark bit. You know what? I think I'm gonna. I might leave the swipe alone, you know. As I just do that little pattern. <laughs> <laughs> I was just about to say. Because. I think I actually like the rest of the swipe. It looks good. Yeah. 
Yeah. Now, we can spin the crap out of it. It's the exciting moment, or I think I better pop some bubbles, right? Yeah. Well, hang on, because I'm not allowed to touch that while I'm in this state. You get all poopy, because I kill your torches. You do. Then again, I think I'm growing as an artist. You I actually be. haven't dropped one in the slop bucket for about two weeks. That's because I moved the slop bucket. Well, it was good for you. <laughs> it's one of your best ideas. <coughs> yeah, it definitely was. Yeah. That's pretty. You like? I do. It's looking pretty flat too. All right. Woohoo! There we go. Love it. Double swipe, bloom center. That's pretty. I love them gold cells. They look cool. We'll do a close up for you. I shall plop her down. I'm quite happy with her. She's pretty. Yeah, real pretty. Rocking the blue night. Love it. I haven't rocked blues for a while. I've been going off on the red, orange, and yellows. You have, yeah. So, back to my favourites. I hope you enjoyed that one, guys. And I think we might have finished that um, flyover reel by now, huh? Pretty close to it. So, I'm a thinking. We're going to come back and see what you've got for us. Sweet. Let's rock it. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. All right, press pause. Okie dokie, my guy. So, what I am going to do is do things a little different to you. Since when? <laughs> Since always. Yeah, well, you don't want to do the same. That'd be just bleeding boring. Exactly. I still reckon you got black in that. I did maybe drip a little black into it. Because it's definitely not the same arc orange that was there yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> well. Dobbin. Dibby Dobber. Yeah, well, you always point it out when I do it. <laughs> well, that's my job. So that used to be arc orange. Now it's just a darker shade. It is. <coughs> There's neon yellow. I do love that neon lit yellow. It pops. Done it what? Mm. Like it's a retina burner. Yeah. Oh, what about when it looks like under the black light too? Yeah, it's crazy under a black light. So is the arc orange when you don't put black in it. <laughs> <laughs> Firebird red. Firebird red rocks. I love Firebird red. All right, so that was the proton purple. We'll go with a quinacridone. You've got such a thing for quinacridone, don't you? E oh, dude, it just floats my boat. That's one of yours that you just sprinkle everywhere, isn't it? It is. That's Conacridone Magenta. Bye. It's them. <laughs> Did I put you on the spot, Nick? It's Hillia. Oh, there we go. You weren't stumped at all. No. No, I wasn't. I almost was. Too quick for bubbles, weren't you? Yes. And then I've got quinacridone, red violet, which is by Atelier as well. That's another one of your favourites. I do love it. Ha! Ah, are you going to do loaded palette knife swipes for yours? Magma magenta. Aren't you? i just seen the look on your face. Which is an eye candy. Yeah, that's nice too. You seen what? Mm -hmm. Loaded palette knife swipes. What are you on about? You know. I'm watching you. Hmm? No doubt. There's my green again. UFO green. You do love that. I do love UFO green. It is like. Whoa. Right, so. 
what I'm going to do to start with is grab my little swipe tool and put some selector beta down, which is the usual Amsterdam oxide black mixed with Australian flow troll. You're not going to bloom it. No. I told you I was going to change it up. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's like when we were talking about the uh, the triple blooms on these. I was wondering what the triple radials would look like. I'm going to try that yeah. next on the big one. Definitely. On the big version of this, I think it would look what? To be continued. What do you reckon? Absolutely. Next experiment night. Yeah. So, what I'm going to do is grab my little palette knife here. Put some Selectivator on it. And a couple of colours. Don't those colours look amazing? Like that. Aren't they gorgeous? Love them. Mmm. Very much. Oh, look at that. I love how the purple and the pink blend together. They're gorgeous, aren't they, together? I do like it. Mm, it's really beautiful. That section was annoying you, wasn't it? It was. I seen you kept looking at it going. It was like no. frustrating the living out of me. Gone now. Yeah, so that's a palette knife swipe on one end. Yep. I think we'll do a normal swipe on the other end. Mm. Jeez, I love them two together. Not usually a pink girl, but they really complement each other. They do. That's the Magnum Magenta. Mm. Which mm. is not quite pink, but not quite magenta. Mm. And on the black, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty. It is super cool. Oh, so we'll put some selectivator on there. Oh, I can hear the possum. <laughs> He's back again. Where he gets crankier in winter. Everybody does. Probably because he's freezing his butt off outside. It could be. I'd be cranky too if I was stuck outside all day in winter. Me too. That's usually what happens. Hmm. All right. So, what I'm going to do is start with that. Let's see what happens. And see. What happens? That's pretty. I think that's going to open up nice with the radio.
And remember, woman, you still got a big pillow? I do still got a big pillow on that. I'm just reminding you. Perfect. All right, I'm going to give that a bit of a spin, see what it does. Like a suction cap then here. Oh, yeah, it's like that. That radio is hypnotizing to watch. Isn't it? It's like something out of Austin Powers. Did you just get a handful of my black goo? Yep. He has claim. It's okay. Okay. It's our little halfway point. It's the play point. Oh, come on, tie a shoelace. <laughs> There we go. Go Wombat, you can do it. <laughs> the bubble shoelace. There you go. You made my night. Just for you. Thank you. Super excited to be here. Does that mean if this turns out super cool, I get some credit? You get all the credit because it's like... They look cool though. Yeah. Look at the colour in that thing. That magenta is crazy. On the black, that is just gorgeous. Yeah, look at that open up. Ooh, pretty. All right, we'll give that a bit of a torch. That's wild. If only you could save some of that that went over the side. I know. There are some spectacular cells up this end. So that way we got two different swipe techniques on either end mm. that give Different designs. Yeah. Different effects. Yeah, different outcomes. Even different sh uh, shaped cells when yeah, you look at the those. the shells that set the shells. Seashells, seashells, what's sure. Say it three times quick. I can't. The, yeah, the cells that are a different shape, totally different. Yeah. Which, it's really cool and trippy. So, what we'll do is pop that one up if I could find where I put the thing. There it is. We've both been losing that today. I know. That's what happens when you experiment, Dave, because you're just putting stuff everywhere. Yes, you do. So. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, I think What I'll do is I'll do a flyover yeah. of that so you can see it a lot better. Tell you what, I'm more partial to these cells. They are cool. They're totally different looking cells. More like snake skin. Yeah. Isn't it? So what I'll do is. That's really cool. Just clean the bottom off that. Yeah, we'll, um... Doing a flyover reel as we speak? Yeah. We've got that running, so you can have a closer look. Now, the side on the left is the one that has the normal type of swipe. The one on the right has the... Palette knife swipe. Yeah, I love the palette That way knife. you get to see which side was what. All right. I'm definitely partial to those palette knife swipes. Yeah, the cells are just way different, aren't they? they they've got more depth. Yeah, and notice they... They get a 3D look. Yeah, you get like um, multicolours yeah. inside the cells yeah. compared to the other way. That sort of blocked off more in sections. Yes, exactly. Where this blends, it's just wah. 
to be continued on that one, people. Absolutely. That's a load of fun, that. All right, guys. Hopefully you liked that. If you did, hit the like, share, and subscribe. Bring the notification bell. That way you get to see all our videos as we release them. Um, thank you so much for joining us today. Just a little experiment night. Yeah, it was just a bit of fun for us, and you can... Um, we thought we'd share. Yeah, thought we'd share our little experiments with you. So, all right, guys, that is it from us this week. So, have fun, take care, and we'll, and we'll see, see you in the next, next one. one. Bye for now. Have a fantastic day.